thought the fifth fragment of the Sharaman was terribly dangerous. I'm so glad you were there to give us a hand. Hmm. And that you had fun, too. Oh, well, if you call risking having your neck broken by that filthy demon fun, well... I wasn't thinking of the dangers of Ego Khan so much as those of Miss Keyhole. Oh, love a duck, don't even mention that Sergeant Major in skirts to me. I'll break out in hives just thinking about her, I do. Anyway, just where are you right now, lovey? We're on the White Cliffs of Dover, and very soon we'll know where we have to go to pick up <gasps> the next to last fragment of the magical Sharaman. <laughs> I need my frying pan! Well, of course well. I'll let you know where we're going, Daddy. You asked for it. Hello? 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 Cut off again. Ben, how could you? You cut off my antenna. For you, it's an antenna. For me, it's my unique, irreplaceable ancestral frying pan. And today I'm going to make fritters. You love them. You could have at least warned me. I've been trying to for half an hour. Well, you didn't try very That's hard. That's wobbling. You sound like a pair of fishwives. We still have to decipher the astral map and find out where the sixth fragment of the Sharyman is. That's right. But first of all, I have an <gasps> immense announcement to make. I've done it. I've created the super transformation gig. <laughs> Narrow. Wood. <laughs> King size! Oh, oh, that's very impressive, Ali. But for the moment, I'd like everyone's attention. Lightweight! Mm -hmm. Ali, please! Heavyweight! <laughs> Thank you so much. And now for a bit of concentration. Go to it, Tilda. In just a few seconds, we'll know our new destination. Not a moment too soon. It's raining. I'll tell you, it looks more like Noah's flood. We are in England, after all, chaps, and it rains here. This tent is indestructible. Don't worry, it will be fine, apart from a leak or two. But this rain is black. Black as ink. Black as petroleum. Huh? <laughs> It is wonderful to be ingenious. This latest technological marvel should winning me Nobel Prize for evil. <laughs> Just think. <laughs> A cloud to disguise an 800-ton oil tank. It's pity to be wasting so much petroleum. <laughs> but as they say, <laughs> the game is worth the candle, or in this case, map. <gasps> run, run, run. <gasps> Hurry! Come on, Tilda! <gasps> hey! Shut <laughs> up! Service with a smile! <laughs> this time is definitive, absolute, and forever fait accompli. Farhat and his foolish gang are no longer existing. Underwater, quick! He mustn't see him! <laughs> I don't know how to swim. Ah. I cannot waiting to see face of Igo Khan when I am telling him. Do svidaniya, Farhat. My precious pan. Oh, boy. 873 years of exhaustive research, destroyed in a single instant. The next tent must be fireproof. All right, everyone, enough. I get the picture. We have to begin all over again. What does that mean? The Tilda goes back to Oxford, to the university, and there she'll pick up books and files, whatever she needs. In the meantime, I'm computerless. You'll come huh? up with something you always do. As for me, I'll go with Ali anywhere he wants, and we'll rebuild his laboratory. You don't know what you're saying, kiddo. We're talking 873 years of work, 35,000 varieties of vibes, 13,000 potions. Here, potions have been knocked out from under you before. But never the Alchemilia primogenita. What's that? The basis for all the potions. Well, we'll just have to go wherever it grows and harvest a bunch of it. But you can't just... But me no buts, no hesitation, no pusillanimity. We separate. 
and get to work. Otherwise, we won't be there in time for the Shariman. Farhat's right. We'll all meet back on the dunes of the sun in two days. Where are you going? To rebuild my tent. And above all, my frying pan. But how? <laughs> I hope you have a very good reason indeed for disturbing my meditation, Abdul Schnarchkopf. I am having four excellent reasons, Farhat, Ali, Tilda, and Ben. Four reasons which are now buried in the English Channel. Oh. Huh? They are dead, annihilated. <laughs> we have won. In other words, I have won. How did you bring off this brilliant coup? Quickly and efficiently. A big bang, a dive into ocean, and goodbye, Farhat. Uh, it sounds too easy. You are calling it easy? I am creating massive cloud to masquerade the release and setting fire to of 800 tons petroleum? This sounds easy? Important thing is we are now masters of war. Did I hear you use the first person plural, Snatchkov? Fool! I and only I will be master of the world! But if it is true that Farhat is dead, no one will ever be able to recompose the Shariman. Oh. And then I'll have no more need of you! Oh. Oh. Calling all cousins worldwide! Calling all cousins worldwide! Calling all cousins worldwide! Ben 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 is in trouble. He needs his cousins. I must notify them. To all the members of the Ben Cousinhood, Ben 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 is in trouble. Repeat. Ben 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 is in trouble. He needs the help of all his cousins. The meeting will be in the usual place. Do not fail and pass the word to everyone by any means, wherever you are, whatever you are doing. Your cousin Ben 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 needs you. Do not fail him. Son, what are you doing here? It is not my habit to enter in this unseemly manner, but in this particular case, come with me. Crikey, I'm for it, I am. Uh, come in. Oh, gentlemen, Miss Swanson is back among us. Mm -hmm. At last, oh. the prodigal daughter Welcome has Welcome back home, young lady, and welcome back to work. I haven't really come back, sir. It's just that I need to... Uh, we're all most eager to find out just exactly what the object of your current research and of your extraordinary oh. abilities... Well, since you're so kind as to inquire, I have no hesitation in affirming that my research is going quite splendidly indeed. Unfortunately, yesterday there was quite a vexatious setback. I'm sorry to hear that. Is there anything we can do? Our modest qualifications are all quite at your disposal. Oh. Of course they are, my dear. Now, why don't you just settle down and illustrate the problem for us? Since I did not have the satisfaction of destroying Farhat personally, I will do what I can. Do as you like. With Farhat dead, life has no more meaning for us. <laughs> such courage, such noble dignity. Uh. But don't play the hero uh. yet. You have no idea what horrifying tortures I have in store for you. Oh, sorry. Did I hurt you? Why don't you have a nice, refreshing little drink of petroleum, Your Majesty? It's finest uh, like sweet crude. Knock it back and then we'll light a little fire and... What is this? I sense a presence. I sense danger. What is it? Ah! Uh, 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 uh. Uh, for heart! 
The Alchemilia primogenita is a flower that grows only in molten lava. There's a flower that grows in lava? That's right. And in the lava of only one volcano, the crack a crack Oh, what a sweet-sounding name it is. The really precious things in life are not to be found right around the corner, Bubula. And just where is this predicate crack or whatever? You'll see it tomorrow at dawn. That is, if you start hustling a little. Kuwait, big. Saudi Arabia, big. Venezuela, big. The North Sea, big. All oil in the world will be mine. Oh, Eagle Khan. You frighten me. You are a brainless imbecile. Oh, no, no, no. I am sorry. I am not seeing you come in. You never see anything, you fool. Oh, oh, please, please putting me down. Oh, 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 oh. Would you please tell me why you're so angry? Because I killed Farhad? He happens to be still alive, moron! It's not possible. I am seeing him falling Silence. into the ocean. That cursed boy is now on his way to the Cracker Crack Volcano! Are you being sure? Look! Oh, my goodness. As usual, you are right, Master. Very well, gentlemen. I'll tell you why I've decided to come back to Oxford. Hmm. I'm sure you're all aware of the Pyramid of Kanchatak, the one all the most famous archaeologists in the world have been looking for for 150 years. Well, gentlemen, I found it. Incredible. Good where Lord. everyone where was wrong was looking for it in Egypt, whereas it's actually, well, I'd rather not say until I have incontrovertible scientific proof, I'm sure you understand. That's why I need to consult the archives and libraries of King's College. Well, of course. Indubitably. Those are my conditions for staying on. Uh, Miss Swanson, we shall be delighted to offer you our full cooperation in the name of archaeology and for the good of our beloved Oxford University. Yes. Cousins! Cousins, your attention, please. Dearest cousins, I wish to thank you for your enthusiastic and rapid answer to my call of distress. Family is family, after all. <laughs> yeah. Of course it is, of course. But I am nonetheless aware of the enormous distances and inconveniences you have suffered to rush here from every corner of the world in order to give me all the newest scientific and technological marvels, all necessary to rebuild the Tent of Cousinhood, which has been indispensable on numerous occasions to my young master, Prince Farhat, in his struggle to overthrow the forces of evil. <laughs> And now I would like to proceed to the packaging ceremony. The tent of cousinhood is once again among us. Cousin Ben, Brother Ben, you have forgotten something. Cousin Ben, Ichiban Ben. Could Professor Archibald Fotheringay Williams' study on ruminants be of any use to you, Miss Swanson? Afraid it doesn't have much to do with the topic. One of my best works, I always thought. Pity. You have no intention of staying, and this is not about a pseudo-Egyptian pyramid. Mm. This is still some more of that folly about Ego Can rising from the center of the earth, is it not? Mm. Ego Khan exists, Miss Keyhole. Pardon me, were you mentioning Ego Khan? I believe, yes, I have run across a reference. A Sumerian legend, if I'm not wrong. It's no legend, I assure you, Professor. Ego Khan is an evil being who could destroy the entire planet. Hence my little deception. But this is about one of your ex-pupils. He is in very great danger. Oh, dear. Uh, who might that be? Prince Farhat, sir. His Highness was a credit to King's College and was graduated magna cum laude. His Highness Prince Farhat in danger. This is not to be tolerated. I beg you to tell us every detail of this deplorable situation. Yeah, what did I tell you? It's dawn, and that's crack a crack. Let's catch our breath before we start the climb. Snarch cough! Howling sandstorms! It's time to use the last potion. Come with me, kiddo! That cactus isn't gonna provide much cover! Trust me! Let's have the giganticity gig! Wah. 
I really stuck it to him. Ego Khan can cause hurricanes and earthquakes. He can raise a piece of fog in the midst of the desert or create tidal waves a hundred feet high. And tell us about the other one, this Narchkov. Greedy, rapacious, underhanded, and sly. I quite understand. A businessman. Spot on, Professor Jones. And what are they trying to accomplish? To prevent Farhat from rewriting the Shariman. The Shariman? A crystal of unknown powers. The ancient Sumerian legends refer to it as the source of pure and inexhaustible energy. And bear in mind that at the time there were fertile plains where the desert is now. Miss Swanson, are you perhaps suggesting that this... Shariman. That this Shariman might be able to solve the energy problems of the entire planet? Free us from our dependence on petroleum? petroleum? I don't know. But no one will ever know if Iga Khan succeeds in stopping Farhat. But why is this young lad the only one who can reunite the fragments? For the same reason it took St. George to defeat the dragon. Getting a bit fanciful, what? They said the same thing about Einstein's theory of relativity. And the law of gravity. Our duty is clear. We must aid this courageous young lady. <laughs> I quite concur. Tell us what you need. <laughs> Cousin Ben Ichiban, that is the most beautiful frying pan I have ever seen. Ben, she is yours. Take her. I'll be true to her. Upsy <sighs> Daisy. <sighs> Goodness, I'll keep whatever it is growing a pleasant clade. If it was that easy to get, everyone would have some, and you'd have too many alchemists and potions and gigs in the wild. There they are, the little beauties. See them? On the rocks there. Yes, but how are we going to gather them? Miss Swanson, hmm? just a moment, I have something for you. Oh, go ahead, open it. Oh, this is just wonderful. I Thank trust you. it will be useful. I've added a hundred thousand gigabytes. I, 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 I just can't find the words to thank you with and... Uh, oh, it's quite unnecessary. Why this sudden change of heart, if I may ask? Let me put it this way. I'm beginning to remember certain... Uh, Salient details regarding our last encounter. Ah, that can only mean you remember seeing Ego Khan. Hold high the honor of the college, Miss Swanson, and teach a lesson to that evil brute. You can count on me. I'll not disappoint you. If I were 20 years younger, I'd go with her. Shall we be reasonable and say 40? <laughs> That's it, kiddo. Now a little to your left. Grabbing one, grabbing two. A couple of more nosegays and we'll have enough stock to last us 300 years. That's how long it takes to grow. Ego Khan! Uh -huh. Help! Get out of there, Shadow! Yeah, maybe it be by. Oh, don't you know it's strictly forbidden to pick flowers? He's destroying all the alchemelia plants. There's just that one. Ali, quick, you have to get it. Helamashin Shamash Shalenki! Howling sandstorms, that overgrown slug is gonna catch sight of me any moment now. This is the last chance. Shadow, come back to me! Hey, Far Hat, send Shadow to get me. Make it snappy. You have to rescue Ali. That doesn't mean I have to like it. Get to it. Now. And now, Shadow, come back to me. You'll have to make do with one plant. You won't get.
get out of here alive! Shall we have a contest to see who's the better aim, chum? Huh? Let me remind you that you're a much bigger target than I am. Hey, the lava's rising. If Ego Khan manages to close the mouth of that crater, we've had it. Yeah, like they say, we're toast. Too quickly! We'll never make it! One sprig will be enough. What are you gonna do? I need just a tiny drop of lava. Ah, here it is. It was stuck in your hair. Hold on tight and uh sorry about this. Ah, up, up and away! I've seen the last of him for a little while. You just might be right for once in your life, Bubbala. And now, off we go to the meeting place, and let's hope Ben and Tilda were as lucky as we were. Howling Sandstorms, uh, uh, here's Ben! Hello, friends! <laughs> Hooray! And look, there's Tilda. But Hunt, Ali. Young master. But Hunt, <laughs> but Hunt. <laughs> oh, but Hunt. Uh, now we're all here, I've got ever so many things to tell you. So do I, Tilda. <sighs> <sighs> Let's save the howdy do's and canoodling for later. Look who's coming. <laughs> I am betting you are not expecting little wizard right now, chum. Sorry, kiddos. Ain't got no time to prepare a potion. I'll take care of this. To two perfect hairs. A very cutting remark. And with that, I think Snarchkov too will be out of our hair for a while. <laughs> if that pan fries as well as it slices, we're going to be living like gourmets forever. <laughs> <laughs> All right, chaps, here we are. The next appointment with the Shariman is in Africa, in the middle of the Sahara, on Mount Alpuzu. Fine then, let's be on our way. Everyone Outside. What's it new, chum? Nothing at all. I just want to show you something. Everyone ready? <laughs> well, what do you think? <laughs> you did it again! <laughs> <Hooray>! <laughs> 